All right, people. As I said in the in the previous video, that I was gonna explain a bit more about WS questions. The first WS question that I'm going to discuss is what. What always ask for information. Information might be um, what is the capital of Turkey, or what dress are you wearing tonight. Or, what is your mother's name? Those are questions, those are information that we, um, that we um, ask, or that we need to ask, right? Or that we need to, to get. Another one is, what, what kind, what kind of, que tipo de, what kind of music what kind of music does what kind of music does she like or what kind of food is your favorite what kind of food is your favorite these are information questions we need to ask we need we get normally information um, when we ask about or when we use what we normally ask about objects probably or we ask about wishes etc where where means donde and always ask for location for places like the school is a place or location is Walmart for example or Super, super 99 is a place like where where are you where are you now and remember that when we ask a question we have to finish it with a question mark where are we going where are we going where is the school where is the school the school is in Parque Lefebvre we're talking about Moscote right the school is in Parque Lefebvre. Who? Who is used to ask for a person? Person. A person is a teacher or a nurse or um, your mother, your father. Who? Who is your math? Who is your math teacher? Who is your math teacher? Who is the president of Brazil or who is the president of Panama? Who wrote the first sentence? When we use who, we ask about a person all the time. So pay attention to that. When? When we use when, we ask for the time. The time in which an event happened. When means cuando in Spanish. When is the next World Cup? Or when is your birthday? Or when will you visit? When will you visit me? We're talking about time here. When. Cuando. Why? We use why to ask for a reason or for a cause. Why are you late? Why did you break the glass? Or why? Why is she sick? Why is she sick? And pay attention to this. When we ask a why, question we need to answer it with because 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 she she um because she ate a a greasy because she ate a greasy food 
because she ate it, sorry, because she ate a greasy food. Because, por qué? Why, por qué? Why is she sick? Because she ate a greasy food. The food was not good for her. Right? Why? And we answer with because. Which? Which has the same or sort of the same meaning as what? But the we use it when we have options or choices. For example, which pen is blue? Which pen is blue? Which means that we have several pens. We have green pens or red pens, but we are asking for, uh, or for a blue pen. Which pen is blue or which pen is green or which pen is red? So we have choices. Which color is your favorite? Which, which color is your favorite? Perhaps you have two or more options and you just want to make sure that uh, the person mm, picks the color that is his or her favorite. So who is, whose is used to show or ask for possession? Um, whose means the quien? Whose car is the Ferrari? Whose car is the Ferrari? Or whose keys are these? Or whose, whose book is whose book is on the table? Whose book is on the table? We'll, we, we can also ask this. Whose book is on the table? Or whose book is this? Or whose cell phone is that? Whose is used for possession? And it means the kin. How? How is used to, to, to explain a process. Um, for example, we ask, how do you learn English? And then that person needs to explain you how he or she learned it. How? How? How to play the piano? How to play the piano? Or how to play the guitar? Or how, how to upload a file on Edmodo? Or how to upload a video on YouTube? But we also use how with adjectives. How? How? How good? How good? Cuán bueno? How good is she at math? Cuán buena es ella en las matemáticas? How good is she at math? How? How far is Super 99? Super 99. Right? How far is Super 99? Cuán lejos está? Is close? Is far? Or how? How um, how cute? How cute is she? Cuán bonita es ella? How cute is she? How is used to with adjective and, and it means cuán. How often? How often um, do you go to the gym? How often do you go to the gym? Yeah. We also use it with adverbs. How often do you go to the gym? ¿Cuán a menudo vas al gym? How often do you go to the gym? So these are the questions or the WH questions that I, that I have included. Uh, um, I'm also going to include the how many, how many, and how much. How many, how many is cuantos or cuantas, how many apples. How many how many apples do you need for the pie? How many apples do you need for the pie? Or how many how many people 
are in this class how many people are in this class how many is used with plural things right things that we can count but how much is used with singular or things that we cannot count for example sugar can you count sugar no we cannot count sugar how much sugar is in the cup how much sugar is in the cup or how much sugar do you need it's better this one how much sugar do you need or how much how much rice um, is in the bag how much rice is in the bag how much and rice is something that we cannot count but we can measure but we cannot count it so how much and how many so please um, I'm gonna wrap up with um, the pronunciation of all the WH questions that you review it what and it's just for um, for information when we want to ask for information where when we want to ask for location who when we would like to know a person or when we would like to ask for a person when when we want to ask about time why when we need an explanation of something or a reason for something or a cause we're looking for a cause or then we use why which when we have two options or choices and we want to ask that person which um, which of, of of the two options is the best for that person and who is is used for or for asking or for showing possession and finally we use how to explain a process and this is it people this is it um, I'm going to um, create a quiz on that model about the WS questions please review the WS question I have also included a YouTube video um, for those students whose um, um, whose listening skills might uh, you know be um, a challenge so I have included a video um, a shorter video about that as well so that you you um, understand what I have explained here over there as well um, once again people if if you have any question please do not hesitate to drop me a message on uh, whatsapp or on Edmodo and I'll be more than glad to to answer your questions as soon as uh, as soon as possible um, take care and I'm looking forward um, um, to hearing from you bye See ya.